And it comes again towards the six yard line. Kuyate! Heads it beyond Neto from close range. We thought he was limping off a moment ago with an injury problem, but he scores his first Nottingham Forest goal. Lodi picks it up for Forrest, chips it back into the back post where Johnson's still there, headed away by Kelly, Nico Williams drives it in, that was blocked by the hand, that's a penalty! Can Neto, having just been booked, redeem himself now by saving Johnson's penalty? This is away to our right, it's a good penalty, Neto went the right way, but you can't stop those. Billing, 25 yards out, he's going to hit a shot! Oh, what a strike from Phil Billing! That's an absolute rasper! Scores at the city ground for the second season in succession, and that is exactly the response the Cherries are looking for. Magnificent hit from the Big Dane. Corner for the left-hand side. Tavernier to deliver it all the way across the box, where Lloyd Kelly nods it back into the mixer. Solanke with an overhead, deflected, and in! It's an equaliser! Dominic Solanke with a spectacular overhead that took a deflection beyond Dean Henderson and within 17 minutes of half-time, Bournemouth have cancelled out Forrest's two-goal half-time lead. It's 2-2. Chelsea have come from behind. That's a poor clearance from McKenna. And Dom Solanke rolls in Jaden Anthony, who puts it into the back of the net. And Bournemouth with three and a half minutes on the watch may have completed a comeback that seemed a million miles away at half-time. They are 3-2 up. Anthony, just come on as a sub, slots it home. Well, that is quite incredible. Oh, my goodness. I mean, you could see what Dominic was, was thinking. Short back pass, please knock it short. And that's precisely what happened.